Hello and welcome to my reaction to episode 5 of uh, Yu Yu Hakusho. Uh, if you've watched my reaction to episode 4, I finished it by saying I wanted to watch more but I couldn't because uh, I didn't have any, uh, enough battery for it. I actually think I do but I'll have to cut the, the talking before the episode. I'll just launch my reaction pretty quick because I don't have nearly enough uh, if I talk too long. So anyway, uh, episode 4 was great. Uh, made uh, Keiko very much more likable, uh, as they did in episode 3 with uh, Sawamura. Uh, Kuba, Ku, Kuwabara, okay, Kuwabara. Uh, yeah, I don't know why I thought Sawamura. Anyway, uh, so yeah, episode 5, let's get into this. As always, kiss anime version, there is no kiss anime intro. Here we go in 3, 2, 1. Yeah, this is definitely the last one I can watch today because I'll have to, to charge my phone most of the day after one. To be honest, if I had uh, if I had enough battery, I think I would watch uh, I would watch more episodes today. I mean, this is the kind of show that really flows well, you know, like time pass quick with it. I mean, I've already watched five episodes today. You know, I'm watching five right now, and uh, I don't feel bored. I mean, obviously it's a long running shonen, so you've got two kind of them. You've got the the One Piece and the until it's until 2011, you know, where One Piece is great, but there's so much filler in the anime, so much, uh, so much like um, how would you call it? Slow that slow slow down scene, you know, to gain time. Uh, that is just so boring at time because they just killed it, killed the pace so much uh, and yet yeah, then you have the Hunter Hunter in 2011 where constantly moving and this one, you know, like Usho so far, definitely feels like yeah. I mean I know it's the same with Togashi but that wouldn't really matter for the anime adaptation but yeah as an anime adaptation of a long running shonen so far it feels like it's going pretty good in terms of pace anyway Let's see uh, him back to life now. Yeah, let's see what's gonna happen now. Yusuke Resurrection, a new trial. Yeah, of course. Okay. Okay. And what's going to get in the way of that? Keiko, a kiss, probably gonna be Keiko.
Okay. Yeah, I'm repeating myself, but it's probably going to be Keiko. I mean, or maybe Kuwabara, because it would be funny if uh, he get kissed by Kuwabara. That would be funny, so I think that might be it in the end. I think it's gonna be him. <laughs> Why does it need to be censored? I mean, they already, uh, I guess they already planted the seed for that last episode when she was trying to kiss him uh, while he was, I mean, before the fire. Sorry about that. Timing, of course. So now it has to be Kuwabara. Let me guess, okay. How the fuck would he figure it out that he got kissed you? I guess there was the dream, but... <laughs> That's some pretty uh, ugly as this. I guess it's... Uh, like in Gintama. Uh, I don't remember how it's called. How they call it? Fuck. A no camera So I guess maybe it will be her in the end.
great music. Hmm. I'm a bit disappointed. Uh, it, it's not going to be Kuwabala. It would have been funny. But it's obviously way better this way for, for the romance between those two. She's gonna make it. Fast. I mean, if it sounded midnight, it's, it should already be too late, technically. It should have worked. Yeah, his spirit is in there, so it worked. Now the question is, can you still see Botan? Oh. But why does he need to do more trial? Now he's back to life, everything is fine. No? Yeah. Because there would be no show yet, but... <laughs> okay. I guess. Okay. Very sketchy. <sighs> oh, but um, I should have figured it out by the voice. So that's just a a human form now? Oh is she in spirit form? Okay, I guess we're getting a bit more of a 
delinquent fight. Uh, the brain of the operation at least. Oh, interesting. Is it you? I'm pretty sure this is you. What's his voice actor name again? I need to check that for a while. Yusuke is gonna help because he's got a debt, quite a debt for Kurabala. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Yeah. They're gonna be willing to get beat up. Don't fucking. They they really made an effort to make the cat look uh, extra cute. Extra. Yeah. Nice. I mean, I'd say go after the, the glass dude because he's very likely to pull out a knife. No. Usually this kind of character definitely pulls out a knife. Damn. 
Okay, that's why. A small uh, Oni. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Spirit realm detective. I've definitely heard that before. Let's see where this is going. This should be good. So for now, I guess I can expect a, a villain of the week type series. Okay. Of course. Yeah. Okay, not watching the preview as well. Uh what was I going to say? Uh yeah, uh, I was going to say, okay, I see we're gonna get a kind of a villain of the week uh show for a while. Like I said before, one of the things I've heard from this show is that it changed uh all the time in terms of uh, what it is that's one of the things I know about this show like it changed in terms of I think I heard something about it being once like a detective a monster of the week a mafia story a tournament arc I mean yeah like I said I don't really remember I'm sure I watched a YouTube video of someone recommending the show and that's where I got all this information I don't have any major spoiler you know um, Except what I just said, more or less. And yeah, I know I've heard the the the, 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 the detective part before. You know, I'm I'm uh, saying something interesting uh, in the staff list on my enemy list. I see there is a foreigner, Cook Justin. Uh, producer and idea director. Uh, there's another guy, Watson Buddy. No, I guess it's probably for the dub, so who we'll give a shit? Anyway, um, I wanted to look something up. Oh, yeah, that's right. If uh, I was right about th that guy being voiced by Joe Box actor, let me check. Uh, Brando. Dio. Uh, wait, there's two. I think it's Koyasuta Keito. Let me check. Um, you. You. Nope. Maybe it's the other guy, or maybe I was just wrong. Uh, Mid Midorikawa Ikaru. You, you. 
Nope, okay. I'm not finding any results, so I guess I was wrong. Which is fine. And sometimes the first have to do something like, even though it's kind of weird because Dio's voice is so unique and stand out, but that eh, might be my mistake. Anyway, uh, yeah, I mean, a good episode to end it for me today. Definitely uh, give me stuff to look forward to tomorrow. I mean, this definitely feels like a show I will watch daily. Uh, I mean, like I said, I just watched five episodes today, and if I had enough battery, I would watch. Uh, I would watch more because it just passed pretty fast. Very good pacing. That's what. Uh, that that's what I was really hoping for this show. Like the pacing wouldn't be trash, and I wouldn't get bored because the second I would get bored, I would drop this show out of reaction. But yeah, it's doing phenomenally. Phenomen. Fuck, I can't pronounce it, so I'm gonna choose another one. It's doing incredibly well uh, in terms of pacing. Definitely looking forward to seeing more. Uh, and yeah, really good show so far. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. See you in my next reaction.